walking to work. Beautiful morning. It's about 75 degrees. Can't beat it in beautiful downtown Boise. Large, maybe an extra large. Um, made in Italy, which is unusual for uh, this style of jacket. We've got a couple of maps. They're reproductions, but vintage on canvas Idaho maps. One is a 1899 Crams, and one is a 1949 deer hunting map. Um, I'll put together by myself. Um, some of my artwork on the wall, and then a nice, beautiful Art Deco table with a hood ornament um, to give that full Art Deco flavor. I like to display all my stuff in a in a Victorian area or 1890s era display cases. So as, as you can see here, I've got some vintage bandanas. Some of these go back to the 50s. Um, some chrome cocktail shakers, a silver frame. Bolo ties are always popular here. Hand-painted ties as well. And I've got a Pendleton, a collection of Pendleton blankets, including a Chief Joseph blanket and a Glacier National Park blanket, a couple of Beacon blankets, and a 1911 crazy quilt with um, several of the names of the family on a Pacific blanket from the 50s. It would be known as a lap blanket or a stadium blanket. Some engineer caps from the 40s and 50s, some old shoes. This is a really unique piece. It's a blanket sample swatch catalog type item that you could, um, you'd have at a store back in the, in the day, and you could choose from this the kind of blanket that you would like to order. I don't know who the uh, original manufacturer of it is, but there's a, a lot of different striped blankets. I'm assuming it's not Pendleton. I'm thinking it's probably a Utah brand. Um, this is also from probably the 50s. So move over to the case. We have lots of bolo ties and belt buckles and an extensive collection of knives from a um, artisan. Um, also patches and pins. Everybody likes to put those on their jackets. So really great collection there. And then a lot of just men's items. This is an art piece by myself um, with that is made from um, a collage of Vintage bingo cards, playing cards, advertising. It's Joe DiMaggio and a little Coca-Cola in the background. The frame is all done with an old orange crate label and a couple of other pieces of vintage wood. I have a collection of gloves and hats and a medicine ball from the era, some arts and crafts furniture. Uh, you can also get an extensive collection of those thick leather belts that um, were great for the era and hold up over time, unlike today's belts, which are laminated and not as apt to last the length of time that they should. A beautiful collection of silk swing ties, a few um, skinny ties um, from the era, as well as some scarves and cufflinks. Get a great um, collection here of postcards and cards that are themed for Idaho and the Boise area that it's my artwork. Items on the shelf here are a war bonnet, uh, kids style, um, some old radios, bookends, a, the, a real birdcage from Japan, some art pottery, leather books, full selection of magnets. We need to restock, it's getting a little low, and a bunch of stickers that you can stick on your car. Um, coming up, I'm going to show you, this is just one room, so I'm going to show you the other room of my store, and it's chocked with men's vintage and uh, other items.